aware of, of what you're doing. Because if you were limping there, limp looking to fold everything, Ooh, that's not going to work this out. This could be disaster for Emma. Um, you know, it's it's so tough when, when there's a player at the table that hasn't, you know, been shown to three bet once light, but is also a very strong player. And just a flat from Jack. Um, we obviously see, oh my goodness, Jonathan. <laughs> and this is going to be brutal for Emma, too. She has to perceive that. Oh, it's a massive wow. disaster for everyone but Jack. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my goodness. Wow. You definitely can't fault the way Emma popped it in there with the ace queen. Ace king has to be all in. <laughs> brutal. We hear the buzzer going off. <laughs> For a few people right now. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so nice of you. I wonder why. <laughs> so notice here if Jack three bet pre flop, Ace King still would have gone all in, but then Emma would have been able to fold I agree. easily. Instead, this happened. So we were both kind of annoyed that uh, he slow played once again, but this time it maximally paid off. Cavs again looking for a four or five of spades here, deuces spades. Any spade to make it a little interesting for him. Okay. Why not? <laughs> and if Cavs again does hit a spade here, no one is eliminated. Wow. <laughs> and we continue at six-handed here at the WPT Montreal final table. And it's oh! a spade! Oh, my gosh. Well, no, I think Jack is out. Emma gets Jack. Oh, Emma gets oh, Jack. No, Jack is gone. Oh, yeah, she covered me. Yeah. <laughs> When slow playing goes wrong. Wow. Wow. What a brutal situation. So Emma situation. loses just 755,000. Not even eight big blinds. And Jack Gong eliminated in sixth position for 175,500 Canadian dollars. Played a very strong, solid final table. He got it in really with aces. Small balling it, trapping with the pocket aces. And a tail 